Sorry, for um, Churchill, you decided not to gain weight. But for Mank, you apparently did pick up a couple of pounds. Why did that inform your character? Why was it necessary for you? Well, um, someone, I felt that someone who's that unhealthy, I mean, the weight that I would have had to have put on for Churchill, I, I could have, I, it, it would have been so incredibly unhealthy. I mean, I would have never have achieved it um, to get those jowls and um, a, 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 to really get that silhouette but, but because, because it was so recognised and so sort of iconic. With Mank, um, apart from one or two photographs of him, uh, no one really knows kind of what he looked like. Um, but someone that unhealthy, I, I don't know what his diet was, but I can imagine, um, you know, and he smoked probably two packs of cigarettes a day and it was a whiskey drinker. So I just wanted to get a kind of that sort of that belly um, and, the, and that you get a sense of um, like the suits that were made for me that Trish Somerville designed. We made them ever so slightly small so that when I, when, I, when I would do the button up, it would pull on the material. It was like a suit that once fit me, but I kind of got too big for it. Mm -hmm. um, so are those little details, um, I, I, it's ironic because I called up Christ, Christian Bale <laughs> and I said, what, what did you, what diet did you use to put all that weight on for Chaney? <laughs> And he, and he said, oh, but I heard you, you know, the padding. And I said, no, I want to put on a, I want to put on a little bit of weight. The thing is, though, as anyone. I can tell you, you. Yeah. And then, of course, you know, I, I'm not, you know, I'm not 24 anymore. So I've still got, uh, I still can't, I can't lose it. It's, <laughs> it's pretty hard. It's easy to put on, but my. God, is it hard to uh, take off? But that, so that was what I, that, that, that puffiness, it's all that alcohol and that sugar and the water retention that, that drunks carry. So well, I suppose. It, it really worked for the character and we can't see it on you right now. I also wanted to ask you because he has such a fight for his vision and they say film is a director's medium. Have you ever been in a situation where you've just felt that overwhelming pressure that maybe someone was going in the wrong direction or do you just give yourself up to the, the experience? You have to give yourself up to the experience. You, you know, the hard thing is years ago, you know, if you're in a play and it's not a good production, um, you know, unless it's a Frank Rich review, you know, where it opens and closes in one night, you know, um, you, I've, I've been in plays where you have to go out there every night and you know that you're not in a good production or you know that you're not very good in the play or you've got bad reviews, but it's sold out anyway. That's very hard. That can be quite soul destroying because you have to go and do the play every night for an audience. Um, and, and you know in your gut that, you know, you're in a bit of a turkey. Um, with film, it's a little easier. It is a little easier because 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 it it it's a few weeks and and then you and then you move on i've i've fortunately i've been in a few of those situations but i must say um uh and and also you could be in something where you i don't know you imagine you imagine what it would be like you can Im you can imagine it as you read it and then it ends up n nothing like you imagined it and there's those situations. But I think with Mank, you've got a great piece of material. 
um, an, an era, you're dealing with an era, a, a era that's just delicious. You know, the golden, the back, the backdrop of like the golden age of Hollywood. You've got an incredible um, individual in, in Herman and um, a great script and you've got a great director. I mean, you know, when Fincher sent me the script and, and said, you know, it's, I'm going to do this thing with the sound and I'm going to, you know, I've got this great DP and I'm going to do it in black and white. And uh, you, you really, you, you, I, I got a good sense of how it, how it would end up. It may not be everyone's cup of tea, but you knew that you were going to be in something that, that great uh, dedication and craft had had been applied to it. Was, it was wonderful. Thank you so much for your time. Thank Enjoy you. Time. Nice to see you again. All right. Bye.